How's it going guys and welcome to yet another vlog. I really wanted to make a vlog today because I was pretty in the mood for making one and also I've been making a lot of different types of videos over the last couple of days and I just prefer making vlogs so that's what we're going to do today. I am also making a video over here. I left all my stuff out from yesterday when I made that lens, cheap lens review type thing, video thing. Um, but I'm also hopefully going to make a video today called something like five life five, uh, no five life tips or something or another so that is what i'm going to do today i'm going to bring you guys along with me it shouldn't be a massively long video so yeah we'll see uh, but i thought i'd also bring you guys along with me to you know take the dog out and stuff because we're still in quarantine there isn't a lot to do and the video that i wanted to record outside can't really be done because of the wind so just gonna sort of make the best of it and see what we can do hopefully this will be a little bit interesting for you guys to see how i make my videos perhaps maybe i don't really know anyway i'm gonna get some to eat because i'm starving and then we will we will regroup So I've got my breakfast lunch type thing, I'm going to eat that now and then I'm going to go through you guys, uh, with you guys my setup for, my normal setup rather for recording in this area which is probably a bit more than you'd expect it to be, I'll perhaps go a bit overboard but either way I'm going to eat this and then I'm going to talk about that, how I do it, why I do it and stuff like that so let's do that. So guys what I'd normally do is I'd clear this table and start setting up. But I wanted you guys to be able to see what I could, or like a sort of behind the scenes. So I was setting that D3200 up over there, but unfortunately, uh, I don't know if I can get it to focus very well this, um, but I was trying to get it set up on that screen so I could see what you guys could see also. But that camera doesn't work as live time, whereas this one does. But this one's got the flip screen so I don't need it anyway. So a bit unfortunate, I've just been messing around with that for a couple of seconds, but uh, nevertheless, I'm going to find a way, or I'm just going to record on that one rather, and hope that it's alright. Uh, so, that's what we're going to do. I'm going to start setting up now. I'm going to show you guys a bit through the process. So, let's do that. I'm just going to move this tally out of the way though, because I'm not going to be able to use it. And it's pretty in the way. So, when I start, the first thing I usually do is remove all the stuff from the back of my door. Because, and you might have seen this in one of my earlier videos of this year. Let's put them down there. Uh, one of the early videos this year, I did actually uh, record with the stuff there and there was a bit of a shadow on that back wall and it looked horrible so now I remove all of this stuff I then clear this table because I don't like the table to have anything there that isn't relevant to the video I'm making so like all hard drives and stuff go all this other stuff that I had out for the video I made yesterday will go normally it would be packed away so I wouldn't have to clear so much but like I said, I made a video yesterday, so it's all still out. So everything there will go apart from these little notes, uh, and that's just in case I have like a bit of a brain wave whilst I'm in the middle of the video, or I keep forgetting what to say, which you'll see later on. I do a lot, uh, so I'll just write little notes or something to remind myself, and then perhaps prop them up on the side of my bed, so that I can read them when I get to the bits that I struggle, which is very often. So I'm going to clear this table. Yeah, I'm going to clear this table. So table's clear, I usually lay everything that was on the table before out on the bed so that I don't want to lose it or to damage it so I'll sort of lay it out like this. There's normally less stuff or well, sometimes there's more, it really just depends sort of what's going on. Next we'll do the lighting, so I always put my blind up because I'm going to struggle to do this one handed. But essentially, what I want to do is stop all the farmyard noise because there is a lot of farmyard noise. Um, whether it's tractors or cars or whatever, there's always something going on. It's also what I have this draft excluder down here for to block a bit of the noise. But um, the main reason I'll put my curtain up is because that is light that I can't really uh, control. So. You can be watching the video in one minute, my face is really light, the next minute it's a bit dark and then it's a bit light and stuff and it's all because of the interference from the window. So, what I do is I get rid of that, I run 
some LED strips around here talk nice which keep coming unstuck and it's quite frustrating but what can you do and I'll run them via this power bank normally a different one but this thing I can get hold of at the minute and I've lost my other one which is a nightmare but I'll run it off that power bank which will make nice green lights around there I need to remove them letters that's why I keep my letters um, so yeah run green lights on there and then I'll show you my other lighting setup so this this is my usual light setup I've got the big light box uh, I don't know if you guys can tell very well but it's at a bit of an angle so it's not directly at me it's sort of going a bit to the side I've got this little light down here and I use this and this little light down here as like shadow removers because I can get a lot of shadows cast around here like you can see here and my actual shadow and stuff here uh, and they look horrible in the video so I use them to cast light there and there to remove the shadows and then I use the main light just to light me and whatever I'm talking about so I'll put them on now and let you guys have a look so like now you can see me I've got a bit of a shadow there and I don't quite know what I don't normally oh no okay so I've got a bit of a shadow and that's because I've not pointed my lights quite right so this will be where I'll put my camera in put you guys in here and then I can't actually see it at the moment because I've just looked straight into that light down there but I'll look and I'll normally take like a photo and figure out if there is any shadow in there probably is there because that doesn't look turn enough I can't see a thing it's so bright um, so I'd normally take a photo now look at the photo and make sure I'm happy with everything that's in the scene ah the other light wants that so I'll also run those as well unfortunately on this power bank I can only run my LED strips and not the actual Hayden Lion light board thing uh, on my other power bank I caught it they had two USB outputs which is really annoying I really need to find that because I like having that go for now though that's probably about it so what I'm going to do is for now I'm going to put you guys on this camera here so you can see like a special behind the scenes thing so you guys can hopefully see me now from over there I might have to adjust the angle um, but I don't really know yet I'm going to have a little bit of a play around with it make sure I'm happy with everything and then I'm going to start my 5 life tip video or whatever it is so I shall see you guys shortly so guys I'm hoping that you can hear me and you can see me well enough from over there I've got my tea, I've got my notes and uh, I've got all my little prop bits ready for this video one thing I will talk to you guys, although I've got everything set up, I am actually thinking about putting these up. I've got, I like soundproof sort of material and whatnot. I'm tempted to stick them on here, uh, on this back wall, but I'm not sure, especially with them being shiny. So perhaps I'll see if I can take the back off and tape them the other way so they're just the normal phone colour. I really don't know. Um, or perhaps even I'll try and find a way of putting them here so my voice isn't going around the whole room when it goes back. I don't know, but if you've got any ideas, please let me know in the comments what you guys think. So anyway, we're going to start the video in a second, and this is where you'll find that I end up messing up lots and lots and lots of times, and uh, why it probably takes me way longer than it should do for me to make a video. I don't really know how this has become like a how I make videos video, but it kind of has a mix with a bit of what we'll go do some other cool stuff later on. I say cool stuff, we'll just walk the dog around the field because you can't really do much when you're quarantined, but we will do some other stuff later on. Hopefully this is a little bit interesting. So I've just realised I wrote all my notes down underneath. Uh we're gonna start with. How's it going guys and welcome to my five live tips. And this is what I've got to put with it all the time. I don't know if you guys heard that, but that camera more than likely did. It's the doors and stuff with people going around in the house. And it makes a lot bigger bang than it does in real life. And it is a nightmare. How's it going, guys? And welcome to my five life tips. I thought you guys would appreciate a video on five life tips that I've picked up throughout my life. And, uh, yeah, hopefully they might be useful for you one day or... What am I saying? What am I saying? How's it going guys and welcome to my... What video am I doing? Right. How's it going guys and welcome to my five life tips. 
Uh, I'm gonna leave you guys here. I'll, I don't know. We'll pick up the video when I've managed to do this one. Because I am terrible. So I shall see you guys. I have no idea where I am on this lens. I shall see you guys when I've done this video or when I'm part way through or something like that. I don't really know. Well, I'll see you later. So, guys, it took forever, but I've finished the video. I'm not 100% sure that now will be when I'll start putting it into my editing software just to make sure there isn't anything that I've missed out. Because if I did miss anything out, now will be the best time to record it, obviously, whilst it's all still set up. So, I'll start putting that together, have a quick brief look over it, make sure that it looks about right, and then I shall take you guys to go get a cup of tea, because I need another tea. And then we will go and see Ragley and take him outside and that wind sounds terrible outside. But we'll go out and hopefully have a nice time. I don't really know I'm going to take you out there with the wind being so bad. But we'll figure it out. So, if you're interested in how the video's turned out, go check it out. Because it should be up before this vlog's out. Should be. So I usually turn that light off because it uses a lot of electric, the other two are LEDs so I usually leave them on, try and normally turn them off uh, but I'm hopefully hopefully going to find if there's any problems pretty quick so I'll be able to you know, do my video straight away. You guys are back on the normal camera so hopefully quality's gone up. Imagine if that video that you guys saw from over the back was actually better quality than this, that would actually kill me a bit because that's one of the first cameras I had. And uh, on top of it being one of the first cameras I had, it's one of the first uh, microphones and lenses and stuff I had, so that'd be pretty terrible. Anyway, I'm going to put this video together, see if it's any good, and then we shall go out. Provided I don't have to do any more recording. That was probably one of the, the quickest videos I've ever had to do. It only took me a couple of hours. And that was obviously just the recording process. I've then got like a couple of hours of editing and putting it on YouTube, but... Um, so far, that was pretty quick, which I'm pretty happy about because I was quite far behind on schedule. So yeah, I'm going to do this and then we'll do something, I don't really know. Right, so ladies and gentlemen, I've actually managed to pretty much edit it fully together apart from a little video clip that I want to take of my wall, so uh, I don't really know how that happened, but I think it sort of went together okay and there wasn't much I wanted to cut out because I did so many little clips so hopefully it should be about right. It turned out way longer than I intended. I only wanted it to be about 5 minutes long and it's turned out to be like 14 minutes or something daft so hopefully you guys like it. Go check it out, go tell me what you think. We are going to go now, go get a cup of tea, take Rag outside. I really fancy doing some photography. Um, but perhaps I'll do that later on when I finish this video. Who knows? Who knows? Anyway, I'm sick of being in here. Let's go get outside and hopefully you guys can hear me with all the wind. I'm just briefly hiding from the wind to talk to you guys for a second because basically I want to kind of apologise. Instead of being so much of a vlog, it's more been a like how I make my video sort of video which wasn't really what I was intending I just wanted to make a vlog today and I suppose it has been in a sense because I've recorded sort of what I've been up to um, but yeah it's just become sort of like a long video about how I make my video so I apologise for that I hope you guys find it interesting anyway even though that wasn't really what it was supposed to be um, I've come outside it is really windy that's why I'm in here to talk to you guys but um, I've been talking to you guys pretty much all day about some uh, videos of taking rag out for a walk so what I've decided to do is because I won't need audio really for it I'm gonna go record some clips of rag just running about and stuff uh, so you get to see him a little bit and we're just gonna go on a bit of a walk but it's just more going to be a couple of clips um, of just sort of rag running around to a bit of music probably just like a bit of b-roll I suppose uh, and I'll keep it brief because I know this video has probably become massively longer than I ever intended it to be so so yeah so guys
so guys we've come to the end of the video like i said before it's not really what i expected but it is just kind of what it evolved to be thank you guys so much for watching i hope you found it interesting i hope you've enjoyed this video and i hope to see you in my next video thank you guys for watching